think darkness is your ally? Are you merely adopted the dark? Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the most noteworthy movie fight scenes from each year of the 21st century so far that have delivered on the thrill, choreography, and sheer violence. Two thousand, Yu Shu Lian versus Gen Yu, Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon. There are a lot of fantastic fights in this influential wuxia martial arts film. However, this one not only tops the others, it also surpasses every other memorable movie clash from the first year of the new millennium. Following an argument, Yu Shulian battles the younger Gen Wu, who wields the powerful Green Destiny Sword. Shulian's greater experience is apparent, as she uses a wide variety of weapons in the training room against her lesser skilled opponent. The beautiful, lightning fast choreography and creative use of weaponry makes this a top notch duel, and one of the best sword fights of the 21st century thus far. <laughs> Two thousand one massage parlor fight rush hour two. Jackie Chan is one of the kings of martial arts movies, and the rush hour films are some of his finest Hollywood efforts. In the second installment, Chan's character Lee and his American partner James Carter investigate Ricky Tan. Ricky, did you hear what I just said? I'm busy too now. Get on your feet. Get up. Get on your feet. I know you. You are Lee's American friend, right? No, I'm Lee's new muscle. And don't let this robe fool you. This is the only color they had left. Now I said get up. They confront Tan at a massage parlor, where an unfortunate number of the clientele are Tan's men. The ensuing fight is a great example of Jackie Chan's signature style, seamlessly blending humor and action while incorporating the environment into the choreography. Towels, chairs, garbage cans, everything is fair game. And Carter pulls his weight too. It's a fight that's as funny and entertaining as its unfortunate conclusion. I ain't never been humiliated and embarrassed like that in my whole entire life. I'll be running around Hong Kong butt naked. Thanks to you. Thanks to me. Yeah, thanks to you. 2002, Nameless versus Long Sky, Hero. Truth and fiction are blurred in this beautiful wuxia film. A nameless swordsman recounts his encounter with Long Sky, a master spearman to a king. Their confrontation unfolds in a courtyard under the pouring rain, accompanied by a musician and operatic shouting. <laughs> As the two stand poised, they begin to visualize their battle, depicted in black and white. Their imagined clash is incredibly intense, combining quick, rapid strikes with the more fantastical movements Wuxia is known for. And it all builds up to a real final strike from Nameless. The intensity of the fight is beautifully contrasted with the serenity of the music and atmosphere. Plus, it pits martial arts legends Donnie Yen and Jet Li against each other. 2003, The Bride vs. The Crazy 88, Kill Bill Volume 1. Honestly, our pick for this year was a toss-up between this and the hallway fight from Old Boy. If that's your choice for 2003, we won't argue with you. Still, our favorite remains this explosive showdown from Quentin Tarantino's revenge epic. You didn't think it was going to be that easy, did you? You know, for a second there? Yeah, I kind of did. Silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. Beatrix Kiddo, aka The Bride, faces off against the formidable Yakuza army of Oren Ishii. The Bride cuts through dozens of goons in a gloriously over-the-top fashion, with ridiculous limb removals and blood galore. Paying homage to Asian action cinema of the 1970s, the scene incorporates elements such as sound effects and a ton of wire work. <laughs> Needless to say, this one-woman army fight is a blood-soaked feast for the senses. 2004, Train Fight, Spider-Man 2. Superhero movies have some iconic fight scenes, and this one is among the most memorable. Spider-Man confronts Dr. Octopus atop a clock tower. Where is she? Oh, she'll be just fine. Let's talk. <laughs> 
However, their battle soon moves to a speeding metro train. The duo fights on the top, by the side, and right in the middle of the train cars, making full use of their exceptional mobility and limbs in the choreography. <laughs> And while Spider-Man does get knocked off a few times, his comebacks are incredible. Doc Ock eventually dips, though not before forcing Spidey to save the train and its occupants. You have a train to catch. It's a fight scene as amazing and memorable as its combatants, and it has remained in the public consciousness for years. 2005 Endless Staircase Fight Tom Yam Goon Long take fight scenes are among the most impressive out there, and the staircase battle from this Tony Ja flick is especially fantastic. Ja's character Kam assaults a building solo, working his way through thugs up four stories. The sheer number of stunts and the amount of practice that went into the sequence is incredible. Props are broken, stuntmen take falls, guys are thrown off of balconies. And through it all, Kam is relentless, taking down his opponents with both brutal efficiency and plenty of flair. It's a fight that's often been imitated, though never surpassed. 2006, Huo Yuan Jia vs. Qin Lei – Fearless Yet another thrilling Jet Li fight, this one sees the martial arts star play real-life wushu master Huo Yuan Jia. Huo has an argument that escalates into a fight with rival martial artist Qin Lei at a restaurant. The duo initially clashes with swords, using them everywhere from low to the ground to hanging from ceiling rafters. However, their weapons are eventually destroyed or discarded, and their fight turns into a brawl that concludes with Qin's death. The battle is both larger than life and intensely personal, with the stormy atmosphere and brutal hits only adding to the ferocity. The movie's title may be fearless, but it scares us just how great this scene is. 2007 Bathhouse Fight – Eastern Promises Many of the most memorable movie fights feature some heightened sense of skill or fantasy. This one goes the opposite way, to great effect. Kirill, he's in there. Done. Tom, you will see the stars there on his chest. Russian mobster Nikolai Luzhin is ambushed in a Turkish bathhouse by two Chechen assassins. Naked and bleeding, he fends off his attackers by the skin of his teeth. Despite being injured repeatedly, Nikolai manages to turn the tables on the Chechens by breaking limbs and using their own knives against them. The brutal, stark realism of this scene makes for a shocking and visceral experience that distinguishes it from other movie fights from 2007, and indeed, many other years. Yes. 2008, Ip Man vs. 10 Black Belts – Ip Man in this biopic battle, Donnie Yen takes on the role of the titular grandmaster of the martial arts style Wing Chun. Sadistic leaders of the Japanese Occupation Army force local Chinese citizens to fight for rice against karate masters. Angered by the death of his friend in one of these matches, Ip Man challenges ten black belts. He doesn't just defeat them all, he completely destroys them. The broken bones and powerful rapid-fire hits are heightened by Donnie Yen's emotionally charged performance, creating a fight that's tragic, haunting, and utterly electrifying. Major props to the last guy for not giving up, even in the face of that overwhelming onslaught. 2009 Bone vs. Price – Blood and Bone it may have occurred in a direct-to-video movie, but that doesn't make this blood-and-bone fight any less legit. Isaiah Bone squares off in a match against Pretty Boy Price in an underground ring, observed by a wealthy audience. You're ready to fight, Mr. Bone. And if I don't? Then I'll beat you where you stand. Need I say more? The two of them gradually feel each other out, and while their moves are performative at first, the intensity of the bout increases over time. Price gets too cocky, though, and Bone rapidly punishes him for it. Although he ultimately forfeits, 
it's clear that Bone was the victor here. The setting of two guys in a ring may seem simple, but the choreography is incredible, featuring rapid exchanges, high kicks, grappling, and that remarkable double roundhouse kick from Bone. 2010 – Rotating Hallway Fight – Inception This fight scene from 2010's Inception is just as mind-bending as the rest of the surreal thriller. In the scene, Yusuf is driving a van carrying Arthur and his fellow dream thieves, who are all sedated in a shared dream set in a hotel. Security, huh? You work for the hotel? No, no. I specialize in a very specific type of security. Subconscious security. Are you talking about dreams? Are you talking about, um, extraction? While Arthur confronts several assailants in a hallway, Yusuf flips the van, shattering the gravity in the hotel. This unique concept results in a visual spectacle of a fight, as Arthur and his foes struggle to navigate the ceiling, floor, and walls of the hallway and an adjacent room, all in zero-G. For as grounded as the physical combat is, the use of the environment is out of this world. 2011 – Rama and Andy vs. Mad Dog – The Raid Although this Indonesian action film features plenty of intense fights, including its own spectacular hallway brawl, the standout is undoubtedly the final clash. Rama arrives as Mad Dog is torturing his brother Andy. <laughs> With an undying passion for combat, Mad Dog lets Andy go to ensure he gets a better fight from two opponents. And what a fight it is! On a technical level, their battle is nothing short of incredible, with grounded yet extravagant choreography featuring high knees and several gnarly throws. <laughs> But it's only through pure chance that the brothers are able to overcome Mad Dog's inhuman persistence. The ferocity and violence build and build right along with the music up until the final bloody conclusion. Truly breathtaking. 2012 – Batman vs. Bane – The Dark Knight Rises When most people think of superhero fights, they typically envision the hero triumphing over the villain. This one is the stark opposite. Led into a trap by Selina Kyle, Batman is faced with the mass terrorist Bane. Bane, let's not stand on ceremony here. Mr. Wayne. Despite Batman's skills in building anger, Bane is completely unaffected by his every move. The villain taunts the Dark Knight throughout their battle, before revealing his plans and breaking the hero's back. I was wondering what would break first. <laughs> Your spirit? Oh, your buddy! The near absence of music heightens the impact of each blow, adding to the mounting sense of despair. Throw in some creative use of the environment and many iconic quotes from Bane, and this doubles as a fantastic fight and a terrifying way to establish an antagonist. 2013 Jaegers vs. Otachi and Leatherback – Pacific Rim This 2013 sci-fi epic features several battles between giant robots, or Jaegers, and interdimensional monsters known as kaiju. However, the fight in Hong Kong is easily the standout. We have two signatures, both Category 4s, Codenames, Otachi, Leatherback. They'll reach Hong Kong within the hour. Evacuate the city, shut down the bridges, I want every single civilian in a refuge right now. Initially, a trio of Jaegers are dispatched to take care of two kaiju nicknamed Otachi and Leatherback. But both monsters overwhelm them, destroying two of the Jaegers and crippling the third. Ultimately, Gypsy Danger is deployed and successfully defeats both rampaging beasts. The rain-swept, neon-lit cityscape serves as a beautiful backdrop, enhancing the visual spectacle. <laughs> Even more, the film brilliantly exploits its absurd premise, with moments like a huge boat being used as a bat. It's giant mechs fighting giant monsters! What more could you ask for? 2014 – Kitchen Fight – The Raid 2 
Cinema in 2014 was stacked with numerous breathtaking combat scenes. While the church fight from Kingsman certainly ranks high, The Raid 2 went above and beyond to deliver some insane action in this scene. Rama comes upon the assassin in a kitchen while heading towards their mutual boss. The ensuing fight is a textbook example of telling a story through choreography. It begins with simple hand-to-hand -hand combat, escalates to incorporating their environment, and ultimately culminates in a dramatic knife showdown. Loaded with remarkably imaginative choreography, inventive use of space, and an absolutely vicious conclusion, the kitchen fight isn't just the best of 2014. It's one of the best, period. Even anime pays tribute to it. 2015, Tak and Kit vs. Ko Chun, SPL 2, A Time for Consequences. Ten years later and Tony Jaa's still got it. The Muay Thai master is paired with Chinese star Wu Jing as Tak and Kit respectively. The finale of the film sees the duo battle Ko Chun, the corrupt warden at the prison where Tak works, in a high-rise building. <laughs> The furious two-on-one fight is epic in every sense of the word, from the deft display of opposing fighting styles to the grandiose classical music that scores it. Although Ko Chun's spectacular kick-heavy attacks and sneaky needles prove arguably superior, the warden also illustrates why wearing a tie during a fight is not the best idea. 2016. Team Iron Man vs. Team Cap – Captain America Civil War Despite the intensity and emotion of Cap and Bucky's fight with Iron Man, at the end of the day, the airport brawl is the one everybody talks about. The Avengers disagree over the Sokovia Accords, which would have put them under UN regulation. Ross gave me 36 hours to bring you in. That was 24 hours ago. Can you help your brother out? You're after the wrong guy. Your judgment is askew. Your old war buddy killed innocent people. This leads them to settle things the way superheroes usually do, by punching each other. The wide variety of powers and skill sets play off each other in very satisfying ways. There are so many highlights, from Spider-Man's big debut to Ant-Man's colossal transformation and War Machine's tragic fall. It's such a dense and varied battle that offers something new to appreciate with each viewing. 2017, Stairwell Fight, Atomic Blonde. Another spectacular, seemingly one-shot sequence, 2017's best fight sees Charlize Theron as MI6 agent Lorraine Broughton escorting a defector through Berlin. The duo takes refuge in a building, and Broughton ambushes several KGB agents lying in wait in a stairwell. Even after taking down five of them, the intense struggle continues as Broughton faces her final adversary in a nearby apartment. Am I a bitch now? <laughs> the hits throughout are painful and gritty, with the camera skillfully immersing the audience right in the middle of the action, like a bystander witnessing the bloody violence unfold. After watching such a fantastic fight, you'll be just as out of breath as she is. 2018, Bathroom Fight. Mission Impossible Fallout. Nowhere is safe from fight scenes, not even the restroom. Ethan Hunt and CIA agent August Walker attack a man they want to impersonate in a bathroom. However, things take an unexpected turn when the man, John Lark, proves to be a formidable opponent. Although the scene is perhaps best remembered for Henry Cavill's famous arm reload, the rest of the sequence is equally good. The room gets half destroyed, as the combatants are thrown through walls, mirrors, and stall doors. Amid the chaos, each punch, kick, and elbow hits like a truck in an enclosed space. The filmmakers embarked on a mission to create an unbelievably impressive fight scene, and they undoubtedly succeeded. 2019, Antique Weapons Fight, John Wick Chapter 3, Parabellum. The third film featuring the most feared assassin in the entire underworld, Parabellum offers a plethora of excellent fight scenes. While the tag team dog brawl with Halle Berry's character is also a treat, this one is just too much fun. Pursued by every killer in New York, John Wick escapes into an antique weapons shop. Ah! 
After some impromptu gun modding, he's attacked by multiple combatants. Wick manages to disarm them before they all become aware of their surroundings. Employing every knife, axe, and other edged weapon they can access, the assailants attack each other, at one point even engaging in a snowball fight with knives. <laughs> Blending entertainment and sheer terror, this scene is like a bolt to the brain. 2020, Wunner, Extraction. Tyler Rake is a mercenary hired to rescue Ovi, an Indian drug lord's son after he's kidnapped. Unfortunately, Tyler's team is killed at their evac point by Saju, the drug lord's right-hand man. I need the boy! I won't hurt him! Pursued by Saju and local corrupt police through the streets of Dhaka, this largely continuous sequence unfolds with gripping car chases and intense close quarters combat. The encounter between Tyler and the cops in an apartment complex is frenetic and bloody. On the other hand, his knife fight with Sanju in the street is fraught with tension and anger. It may not be entirely seamless, but this 12-minute scene is impressive nonetheless. 2021 Bus Fight Nobody Bob Odenkirk's Hutch Mansell doesn't look like a badass. Yet you should never judge a book by its cover. When the former assassin is hoping for a fight, one comes to him when a bunch of gangsters get on his bus and harass a young woman. This girl's gonna get home safe tonight. I hope these assholes like hospital food. Hutch makes good on his promise to mess them up, and he does so using his fists, knives, a purse, and anything else he can lay his hands on. No one comes out of this thing unscathed, and the entire scene toes the line perfectly between realistic and gratuitous violence. Sorry about the mess. It's a glorious mess, but we are not sorry it came out on top this year. 2022, Rom vs. Beam, Triple R. This over-the-top Indian epic is jam-packed with amazing fight scenes. The piggyback jail escape is ridiculously awesome. The final forest battle is glorious. But the heart of the movie is the bromance between Komaram Bhim and A. Ramaraju, which makes their fight the pinnacle of the movie and indeed 2022 as a whole. The best friends confront each other in the middle of Bhim's assault on the governor's mansion. <laughs> Each blow hits home that much harder, since the emotion of their shattered friendship pervades the scene, complementing the fantastic choreography and larger-than-life imagery. It truly feels like a legendary clash between titans, one that is only made much better by Ram punching a freaking tiger with fire. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. 2023 20-Minute Prison Escape – Extraction 2 this year had a few formidable contenders. While John Wick Chapter 4 nearly clinched it with that fiery shotgun shootout, Extraction 2 achieved victory with this incredible 21-minute fight sequence. Tyler Rake is out to extract his ex-wife's sister and her children from a Georgian prison. Job starts in six weeks, we take our cut, and for uh, political considerations, you're on your own. If all goes well, you don't get caught or shot in the face, I'll meet you on the other side and give you a kiss. Failing that? It's been a pleasure. Tyler first has an intense clash in a coal room. Then he's forced to transport his former sister-in-law through the prison yard amid a violent riot. That's followed up by a car chase through the woods, culminating in a harrowing train journey, featuring fights both inside and on top of the compartments. Cover me! portion is excellent on its own, but stitching them together solidifies this as the best action sequence of 2023. Did we leave out any movie fight you think emerged victor in its respective year? Share your thoughts in the comments. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.